Hi, this is Superboo3, and I thought I'd just uh, show you some gameplay from Afterburner Climax because I just love this game. Um, I've put the settings on so that I'll automatically activate the final level, uh, regardless of if I complete all the secret missions or not. Um, and I've put my lives up so I'll be able to make it to the end of the game. Uh, the game is pretty tough. I don't remember the buttons, so I'm just going to have to try and work that out now. But I just think this is a really cool looking game. Oh yeah, and I've got the machine guns with Nort FI, because honestly I think that's just a bit needless to be pressing that constantly. Oh yeah, I'm not quite back on the form I used to be, but I just love how the water and stuff looks in this game. That's why it's called Climax, because you go into Climax mode, um, where you can get a giant lock on and it will take out all the ships for you. Alright, I should have saved it for then. Um, I'm spinning all over the place more than I should. The real reason that you actually do the rolling is so, if there's a missile lock on, you can stop it. But I'm not quite used to this game which is why I'm kind of doing it all the time. Pretty sure there's a way to accelerate as well, yeah, there we go. I mean so yeah it's kind of like an on rail shooter. Um I remember I actually played this one in the arcades, I think it was and I remember this playing this an absolute load um, which is why as soon as it was on a uh, PSN I ended up grabbing it I mean just visually it's a very satisfying game to be honest I would want to play this with the joystick more than playing it with the controller it would be a lot more fun uh, I'm just gonna actually go really fast because that's part of the reason this game looks so cool I think that's about as fast as I can go um, you can only go top speed for a very short amount of time. Oh, there we go. I think this is one of the secret targets. Oh, I already managed to take him out. Whoa. <laughs> to be honest, the game just does not get old. I've played this quite a few times already, but I haven't played it in a year or two. I remember getting this like literally on release day. Um, Lure of the Sky looks nicer so I'm going to go that way. Volcanic Island is actually a lot harder from what I remember. Because there's northern lights up there. Wow. You know what, the thing is, it does make me... This is one of those games which just makes me think that games should just look nicer. Like, I wouldn't mind a few simple games just looking nice. It's pretty cool to have. Because this looks, I don't know, if you've uh, played Assault Horizon, when I mean, you see the textures on the ground, it looks so awful. I mean, generally speaking, that game has decent enough graphics, so I shouldn't insult it too much. Um, I mean, my main issues with that game is because they changed the gameplay mechanics and did that dogfight mode thing. Um, but, you know, I'd love to play a game... I mean, to be honest, if I got a game that looked, a playing game that looked like this on PS4, I'd be very happy if it was a free roam one. Um, I mean, when they try and make graphics look even better than this and they compensate uh, by making a lower frame rate and stuff, I just don't think it's worthwhile. Where there's loads there. I think I'm going to die. I do love the smoke effects as well. They're crazy. To actually follow what's going on in this game, um, <laughs> you've got to ha have some Jedi-like reflexes, I think.
I think we're on to another secret mission. Uh oh, and I think I might have already messed it up. Oh, no, there he is. You have to basically just stay on this guy's tail and shoot him down. If you die on this one, you uh, you lose him. Oh, I lost him. Did I? Oh, no, no, I still got him in my sights. I might go take him out. Well, I'm going a bit too fast there. I've almost got him there. Hey, look, there, that's what I was talking about with the spinning. That missile on my tail. No! I need to kill that guy. Wait, I don't, because I've got the mission unlocked already. Because of the options I chose, but I would rather kill him properly. Also, just love the arcade music on some of these old games as well. I think he got away. Oh, nice no, still there. Hmm, Forgotten Glory sounds cooler. Probably going to be harder as well. I didn't want a mountain level. I've only played a few uh, playing games actually on the PS3. Um, I remember playing Dogfight 1942, which I think was in an insanely insane cell where it was like ridiculously cheap. Um, but that was actually really fun. I think I'm supposed to take out these helicopters. Um, but yeah, that was a really fun one, and it, I liked it as well because it had split screen, which is a cool mode to actually have. Um, I think it's always satisfying to play something like a playing game and have a friend there to have your back. You know, some real cool Top Gun stuff. Have your wingman taking out guys here on your tail. I think this is a beautiful level as well. I think speeding constantly is making this game considerably harder than it should be. I'm also not really using Kyle Imax mode all that much, either though I was probably using that more. Well, I've got to say, this kind of made me curious as to if the Outrun game was any good. Um, that was also on PSN. I didn't actually try that one out. I, mean, I know there's stuff like Crazy Taxi on there, but from what I understand, I think those are Dreamcast ports, whereas the Outrun and this were uh, arcade machine ports. Well, it's pretty weird when, in this day and age, that um, arcade machine graphics seem a bit crap. Um, I, mean, I can't remember the last arcade game that I played that actually visually impressed me. It might actually have been this. Why? Because uh, obviously this was out when the PS2 was a console and that this clearly looked better than the PS2 game. I hope you guys are following the plot line. This is uh, complicated stuff, guys. Yeah, I thought I'd just... Oh, whoa. Yeah, I don't think I should be hitting the speed button constantly on this one. Um, yeah, I mean, I just thought I'd put a change of pace because... Um, well, actually, it's been taking me ages to finish the games that I'm playing at the moment. Um, 
I have been meaning to do Resonance of Fate and Devil May Cry uh, HD collection. Um, maybe I'm going to actually have to start uploading more videos. <laughs> That's the thing. I don't want to be uploading multiple videos per day um, for the same game because I just don't think people would watch it if I did that. I think this is a really nice looking level as well. See these kind of levels remind me of Outrun a lot. This is what the old um, I think Sakers did Outrun. Um, the old um, arcade games were like they had like these nice little routes that you'd fly down. Although to be honest, I don't I don't think I played arcade machines all that much when I was younger. I mean the machines I was probably playing were probably very old. Um I won't go nuclear arsenal because that just sounds cooler. Oh yes. Whoa. Yeah, nothing. This reminds me of if you've played uh, Ace Combat 5, I'm pretty sure the final mission on that was similar to this. I seriously cannot just believe I flew through all of that stuff. Oh man. Whoa. Is there still another mission left? Oh right, I have to take these out with my machine gun. This is a pretty cool ending. They'll take him out. I don't think I've ever played this before. I think I would have died last time actually because I, I don't normally turn on the things like those kind of cheats. Um, this is pretty badass. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I know. I've got to save the world, guys. Uh-oh. I know I did it. Woohoo. I'm like the ultimate top gun. I would be so impressed at anyone who did that legitimately. Where were my wingmen the whole game? Okay, see, now I'm gonna just have to play this game a few more times because I've got ending B, like there's multiple endings. And people thought this was a mindless shooter. It'd be great if planes actually flew the way that they do in this game. They'd be so much easier to fly around. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed that, and until next time, bye.